Okay, so now that you've seen the different things that we've been able to, to, to do, you can let your creativity run the course. You know, you can take different elements to move them around. You can put different things in different places. And as I scroll here, you can see some of the things that we've created. And you can create your own. So let's go back over here on the back end. I'm just going to click on to add another column here. And you can move things over. You just drag it over. And if you want to add another column, you click another column, you drag it over. So this is where your creativity comes into play. And if you want to add an additional row, then you can do that. And early on, I mentioned about the different layout options here. So when you click, when you put your mouse on this, it gives you different layout options. And when you click on it, it's going to present you something like this. So the way that you use this is that there are times when you have a lot of content that you want to put on the left side, but nothing very much on the right side. This is when you utilize something like this. And then they have yeah, the reverse of it, you know, something big on the left side. I'm, I'm sorry, on the right side and something little on the left side. So there, you know, there are just a bunch of different options that you can use if you need more of this. And as you click on it, you know, it just automatically shows like this. So this is showing you how the layout on the front end is going to look. So if you have content to fill all this hair with, you can definitely just go for it. But use your creativity. Just remember to um, keep it simple. You know, don't try to, to do, you know, so much that makes stuff looks, you know, a lot cluttered. Because when you do that, then it, it loses the purpose for, you know, why you're creating it. So just keep things simple because people love a simple website. They want something that they can be able to come to and they can be able to find exactly what they're looking for. So now you have this here. You can be able to, you know, go around and just mess with it. You can even drag things to different section here. So I'm just going to drag this here and you can copy those and then just move it over. So right now this is a custom layout. I'm just going to copy this here and put it right there. So I'm going to save this so you can see what it looks like on the front end, even though there's a lot going on, but it gives you an idea of, you know, of what you can do with it. And if you also want to move something up, let's say you want to move this entire row up, you just click on up and it's going to move it up if you want to move it down. So you go over here, you see something that you don't like the, the position that it's in, you want to move it up or down, you click with the up or down arrow. So let's go over now on the front end. Based on what I've moved, this is how the layout looks. But it still gives you a lot of flexibility for you to style your pages, you know, any way that you want it to be.